Hey guys, some of these videos have taken a few attempts, but whatever. So today, I know, I, from Friday on a Saturday. Okay, so anyways, um, I've done a review that I got a new puppy dog, <coughs> along with Steve, and you can hear them in the background. <laughs> That's a smart. Um, so we, um, I take horseback riding lessons, and I was thinking of reviewing some of the things that you're gonna need for a horsey. So, first thing, safety first. You're gonna need an awesome helmet. I mean, like, who needs some black ones? And also, could the horsey show policy change? I ain't wearing no black helmet in a horse show. I'm gonna look awesome. So, I got this on Amazon, I forgot for how much. Um, as you can see on the inside, it came with like the protection pad thing, and the strap, and it's on the smallest it could be, it's a medium, and um, it's called Kaleidoscape. Oh, by the way, after this video, I will give you an update on my puppies. Um, next thing, you're gonna need some snazzy pants, like, let me... So I can. So a butt, and then these things. Like, can you see that? It's kind of like out. It pops out. Well, like it's like to protect your leg, I guess, from the saddle. I'm not very sure on that one. So yeah. And then next, you're gonna need a pretty snazzy shirt. Sorry about the lighting. <laughs> Barely quit. Um, so you're gonna need a snazzy shirt. I'll be right back. Oh, I need to take the tags off. Oh, the pants fell. <laughs> All right, Bailey. Whatever. So we went and got this from a place called the Tack Room today. Um, the shirt and the boots we do. I haven't shown the boots yet, but anyway, it like buttons up and then it has that on it. And then pink, and there's some blue striping, and it is made by, I don't know. So anyways, yes, that's that. And then some snazzy boots. Um, you can get an up close of one. They are pretty nice. They're made by Tough Rider. Um, so I will give you a little tip on riding boots. So, I will tell you the story. Oh, I have to look cool doing it. <laughs> I like it. One second. Okay. All right, so, once upon a, okay. Um, so, one day, my mom decided to order me boots, and it was like 11 o'clock. But anyway, my mom decided to order me some boots. So she did my sush, set, but sush, <laughs> my shoe size, which is three. Well, in boots, they don't do half. So, um, so she got a three, and mine's probably three and a half for my shoes. But so she got a three. And so. I tried them on when they came. They were god awful and my toes were crammed up in the end of them. Okay? So then today on Saturday, um, we went to the store <laughs> called the Tap Room and got these sweet looking leather boots. A very kind lady picked them out, picked a few out. One was too small, one was too big, and one was just right. Uh, by the way, that's more throw my finger. No, paint. Um, anyways, it was just right. So then we bought it, and then we got everything else. <laughs> and I was like, so. Oh. And so, um, then we went in a bunch of other stores, and I stretched them by a bunch of other stores, I was exaggerating. There was only one store. But um, yeah, we went in a bunch of other stores and I stretched them out that, like when you get boots, the leather, it like stretches. Like at first it's like, eh. but then it's like, eh. 
so you just gotta get used to it. Um, I have one more thing to review, and then we can get a catch up on my puppy dogs. I'll be right back. I should take this off now. So we got some things from Briars. Um. So I did get a dream horse. I'm not finished painting it, but I will show you. Oh no, you have. So here's what I got. To make this color, you mix dark blue with black. It's called jet black. Um. But what is it about white? Does yeah. It have any so, um, and then a spirit riding free blind bag horse. I'm pretty sure this is Xerxes. It looked closest to him. But I think it is so cool to see the spirit riding free horses in a briar form. They look pretty darn good. So, um, catch up on my puppies now, right? Hey, Mommy, Daddy, I told my fans I'd get a catch up of the puppies. I found one and two. Jeez. There's Steven. I think it's in that bag. What? What's Sorry. Stevie. <laughs> Steve, smile. Alright, and then found the other one that's chewing on something he shouldn't be. Hi. Go back to the other video where I showed you where I got him. See? The size different. He likes to give me that. He was chewing on this a Lego Playmobil remover block thing. So, anyways, guys, that's about it for today. I'm a pretty awesome skeleton dog dude, and hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.